My name is Colin Skipper. I'm Battalion Chief in Operations on Sea Shift, I'm 1st Battalion, and uh, I've been here in the city of Denton for 20 years. Operations Battalion Chiefs, we kind of manage the shift. I think I started right after uh, I joined the Marines out of high school. I came, was in the reserves. I came back. I had some friends that were volunteers, and so I went and took the test, got hired. I would say Denton's grown a lot in the past 20 years. When I started, we had six fire stations. We just broke ground on Station 9, and we have plans for Stations 10 and 11 and 12 on the books. If somebody has a problem, it doesn't matter what it is, and they call 911 or they call the non-emergency line, a dispatcher typically, if they don't know who to send that call to, they're going to call us, and we're going to go help you out. You know, it, it goes from the winter storm, pipes are busting, we go out and we turn your water off. Um, your cat is stuck in the tree. Yes, we've actually been on that call uh, several times. We're the problem solving department, really. The city of Denton is kind of a destination location for firefighters in North Texas. People stick around because this is a great place to work. Great benefits, great pay, lots of good people, um, and we're supported by the citizens, which is great because we want to do a good job for the citizens, and it's really good to know that they appreciate our efforts and reward us in kind. At the firehouse, we're all, we're, we're the brotherhood, we're the family. You spend 24 hours a day, every third day. You know, you get 24 on, 48 off. We cook meals together, we live together. Back here in the back, you can hear everybody. You can yell out at everybody, you can make noises and play pranks. And, and then, quite honestly, we suffer together too. When we run on those bad calls, those things that nobody else really wants to deal with and so they call 911 and we have to respond and we rely on each other to stay strong and, and get through some of that stuff and to know our job and be able to be effective when the time comes. I don't do the dangerous part that much that often but I do have to put other people's lives in dangerous situations and that part worries me but it also is, is a part that um, I enjoy because I need to prepare myself, I need to be ready, and I need to know that I'm doing the best I can to make sure they're doing something safe and that I don't put them at risk. Yeah.